What's up everybody, welcome back to my channel. And today, I went to my first ever baseball card shop, guys. Yes, I have never been to one in my entire life, and that sounds so embarrassing to say, but it was an absolute blast and a great first time experience to go ahead and step into a baseball card shop. So guys, I didn't go to just one, I went to two. One of them was called Lefty Sports Cards located in Burlingame, California, and the second one was called What's on Second Sports Cards located in San Mateo, California. And I did ask them if I can, like, videotape around the shops, show you guys what they were selling, what they had, and kind of like advertise for them, but they both kindly said no, and again, I have to respect to that. Um, as you can see, I did pick up some cards for myself, and we're gonna show you guys shortly what I did pick up. So again, if you guys want to stop by these places, if you guys are ever in the Bay Area, I highly recommend to go ahead and check out their shops. Again, great people to go ahead and talk to. Um, they certainly were very nice to me when I had a lot of questions, and it was an absolute blast. So guys, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Without further ado, let's get right into this. Okay, so let's start off with the stack that I got at What's on Second Sports Cards. This guy was absolutely amazing. We had a great long conversation about cards and rookie cards and um, what's been going on in the current market of uh, sports cards. So um, one of the cards that I in instantly drew interest to of getting was this Buster Posey Upper Deck Rookie Card. I mean, awesome, great condition. Shows young Buster Posey right there. I mean, this is awesome. Great one to add to the personal collection. Second one was this Matt Cain Rookie Card. That is awesome. When I saw this Matt Cain Rookie Card, when he presented it to me, um, I was like, yo, I have to have this. I have to have this. So, uh, third one, Hunter Pence, his Bowman rookie card from 2007. I think the 2007 Bowman boxes are really expensive. So, this was a really cool one to go ahead and get. Really cool. Hunter Pence right there. Cody Ross, if anybody remembers Cody Ross, uh, won the 2010 World Series Championship with the SF Giants, and he had a great career. Uh, I think he only had one year with us, or maybe two, but it was very memorable. So, how to pick up this one. This one here is something that I've been trying to find for a long time, was Johnny Cueto's like first ever card. It, it doesn't say first Bowman, but it's, it's Bowman Chrome. Even if you look it up, it's gonna show you this card. So I was like, yeah, I have to have this one because I've been trying to look for it for a long time. So Johnny Cueto right there, this one was very awesome. He actually just brought this one up to me. I didn't even think about this, was Brandon Crawford Extra Elite. I think this is from 2008. So this is has to be from when he was I think in the minor leagues, I believe, or might be in the college seasons, but this was absolutely awesome. This one also was another one I've been trying to find, was Sergio Romo's first Bowman card. And I saw this on his table and I was like, I have to have this and really awesome. So Sergio Romo, and then we went to a couple of first Bowman cards here, Logan Webb and Marco Luciano. I thought I would never ever get Marco Luciano. He's a hot prospect in our organization. And I was absolutely glad to go ahead and find um, him in his stack. So again guys, what a blast I had at What's on Second Sports Cards and these are all the cards I got there and it was it was a great experience. So let me show you what I got at Lefty Sports Cards. Alright, so this is what I got at Lefty Sports Cards. So they did nicely put this in a team bag for me and this was also another place I had a blast at and it felt really cool to go ahead and be there. So. I got a lot of rookie cards, that's what I really aim for, just rookie cards, and uh, they had like this binder full of rookie cards, and they were nice enough to let me look at a lot of them, and I thought I was annoying them, but I wasn't actually, so uh, here's one of them, Barry Larkin 1987 rookie card, I was getting mixed up if the 86 was actually his rookie card, but it might actually be 1987, so this is really cool, 1987 Barry Larkin, Norichika Aoki rookie card. Um, Maybe a lot of you would be thinking, why even pick this card up? He played for the Giants. I really like his swing. Uh, very interesting player. Had a great arm, and I was like, I really want his card. And, and, and so I did pick it up. After him, we got Dexter Fowler's rookie card. I think, is this Chrome? Yeah, Bowman Chrome. What, from what year? 2009. 2009 Bowman Chrome, Dexter Fowler. And I saw this in the binder. I was like, a must have too. So after that, Oscar Tavares. Unfortunately, he did pass away, I believe, in 2014, and I I just wanted to get his card, and I just felt respectful to get his card to add to my personal collection. I mean, imagine what he would have been if he didn't pass away. He would have been an absolute great player for the St. Louis Cardinals. 
bright future. Unfortunately, he did pass away, and I think it was in a car crash, but this was one of the cards I picked up. A very memorable card, too, so. Next one, as you probably guys probably know, my 2015 Hobby Box opening was a horrible opening, and I was like, let's get this Joey Gallo rookie card so I can kind of forget about 2015 for a little bit. And I saw this in the binder, and it's actually numbered out of 150, so that's also another cool thing. It's blue, too, so it really matches with his jersey. So, Joey Gallo, 2015 rookie card. Here we have Billy Hamilton, Billy Hamilton's Bowman rookie card. Um, Nicholas Castellanos opening day rookie card. Not a lot of people like opening day. I don't really have a hate towards opening day, but I just wanted Nicholas Castellanos rookie card. And so, here it is. Next one. <laughs> I, when I was about to leave, because I think my parents are kind of getting annoyed that I was in there for a little while, and I was like flipping through the binders, and next thing I saw Barry Zito's rookie card. This is MLB debut, but I was like, no way. I've been trying to find this card for a little while, and I know it's on eBay, but uh, I wanted to see if I can find it in person or something like that. Uh, it sounds a little silly to say, but I saw that. I was like, instant have, man. Instant have. Need to get it, and I got it. And then the final two cards I got was John Smoltz rookie card. I think this is Fleer and then Roberto Alomar rated rookie card. They did have a lot of other cards, but I was like, save it for next time. When I come back there next time, um, we'll just go ahead and get a little bit more of what I should have got. But again, these are the cards I got and it was absolutely awesome. So that is the end of this video today. Hopefully you did like the selection of cards that I made earlier today. And guys, comment down below your favorite card out of this entire stack. And I know that these two shops didn't really want me to advertise for them, but the one thing I will say, and I did say this earlier in the video, that they were really great to me, very patient, answered every question I had, whether if it was about a sports card or about their shop. And again, if you want to look them up, just look them up right on Google, and um, they'll be right there. So guys, thank you very much for watching my video, and I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.